right, y'all. No music. I want everybody to um see this. Um, just want to do a quick, quick video. I'm going to try to make it quick. Y'all know how I am. Heading to school, of course. Um, dress casual today. We're on our way to um a beauty, a nail supply store. A couple of nail supply stores. So, I feel like a kid in high school. Yay, field trip time. So, yeah, we're going to go to the school, clock in. And we are going to, you know, follow each other and go look at some, get some, buy some nail stuff, y'all. But anyway, I just got the phone with my sister. Hey, Shannon. Um, talking about weight loss and eating right and everything. And I was um, just telling her that I had been doing no videos on YouTube for years. And um, well, she's not, you know, she, my, she I thought she knew I was on YouTube. She's not really into social, social media, you know, Facebook or anything like that. But I thought she knew. But anyway, I was just giving her some motivation to talk about, you know, eating right and weight loss. And I was telling her that... Um, I haven't done a video in a while as far as motivation and weight loss. But y'all, when I tell y'all, it is real. When I, it's real. The the um, changing your lifestyle. It is a lifestyle because on um, Sunday, my husband had this overwhelming desire for pig feet, and I'm like, you know, I don't even cook pig feet no more. I don't even eat pig feet no more. Pig feet and hog mouths. That's how I cook mixed together with onions and some vinegar and seasoning. Oh yeah. So I, I made them and I'm like man I ain't eating that shit. But they were so good. I'm like you know what it's been over a year. Let me go ahead and eat me a couple of hog mouths. So Sunday I made me a little bowl of I think I had like one pig feet you know some hog mouths and I had made some red beans and rice. So that was my dinner Sunday. So yesterday last night yeah Monday Got out of school and um ate the rest of the hog moss that was left. Had put hot sauce on it and stuff, y'all. And I ate that and it was so good. But I instantly felt like I was going to have a stroke. When I tell you my head was pounding like my eyeballs was being poked out from the inside out. And I never ever ever you know get headaches and migraines. So whenever I see people I always complain, oh my head hurt, oh my migraine. I, I don't know what that feels like. I've never had I don't get headaches. But when I tell you last night, I thought I was going to stroke out. I was like, oh my God, I was just drinking water, drinking water. You know, sitting in the dark, like always. And I was just miserable. Woke up this morning. I didn't take anything. I woke up this morning and um, it's, my head is still hurting. It's not as bad as it was last night, but my fucking head is pounding. Just for my, And I know from the south. I mean, of course, pork. You know, I, you know, I, don't, I don't eat pork like that. This is bacon or whatever every now and then but yeah I, so i won't be eating no more pig feet i tell you that i won't be eating no more pig feet in hog miles just like when i told y'all years ago yeah years ago i ate those um oxtails and i felt like i was going to die and yeah i haven't touched oxtails since so yeah back on my eating habits you know i was saying telling my sister that at school seemed like every but recently, so like once a week or whatever, somebody's graduating. So we all know bring potluck or whatever. So, baby, when I tell you, I've been eating the, the, the nachos, not nachos, um, the Doritos and you know cheese dip folks bring in, and I ate some some hot wing, yeah, chicken. And I, you know, I know I had stopped eating chicken and sausage and all this shit. And I, on my Facebook, I had boiled those um sausage and crabs and all of that salt. You know, I felt a difference. And I saw a difference in my stomach immediately after eating that. You know, because of the salt, you know. I feel like I had little knots in my stomach. But, yeah, it's, it's real, y'all. The point of this video is that once you get on your lifestyle change and stop eating certain things or whatever, um, it, it's real. You know, you can change your body just by changing how you eat. And once you start back eating those, you know, things again that you've left out of your diet, it, it, you know, it's going to make you sick, like I've said before. So, yeah, so... As of today, um, got my banana for breakfast, and I have been stopping getting, um, you know, the iced coffee. Yeah, y'all know I ain't been drinking no iced coffee in the mornings. I've been in the gym, so yeah. Um, thank God, and I and I'm happy this morning because thank God I'm in these jeans. Y'all know these are my favorite jeans. I haven't worn these in a long time because I couldn't get back because I I couldn't get in them because I had gained no, no that way back. But I'm in them today, y'all. So you know, I I haven't. The only thing I notice is my stomach. You know, my stomach is hanging from all of the junk I've been eating. But I'm, I'm still on track. So give me about a week. And my little pudge I do have down here on my stomach, that's going to be gone. Still haven't got back into the gym since before Essence. Um, I don't know when I'm going to get back into the gym. I'm, I, 
my daughter's birthday this weekend so i have a full weekend ahead so i don't know maybe next weekend i don't know but um yeah back on my eating um that's i've been doing good but i said the last two weeks i've you know potluck and shit i've been eating stuff but yeah get just you know you 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 know get off the track or whatever that's okay just get back on it because your body's gonna tell you i don't feel good so yeah it doesn't it doesn't take long to um doesn't take long to like okay i got to get back on it so yeah just a quick motivation to speak to let you guys know um like my sister said you know when i get any older you know you got to do something especially if you have kids you know that needs to you know lose weight or whatever they they watching you they think that's how it is like i told her we, we grew up together eating all kinds of stuff and you would think that that's all we know how to eat but you know you can change how you eat i've done plenty of videos on it you can change how you eat change how you drink no sodas <laughs> yeah no sodas shannon you know whenever you come to my house you got y'all got to go out and buy sodas i don't i don't buy them I got a coupon, like a couple of coupons in my phone right now from Kroger. Like on Fridays and stuff, free Dr. Pepper and stuff. They probably gonna expire. I don't care if it's free. I don't get it. I don't get it. So yeah, leave the sodas alone. And um, yeah, just quick motivation speech. So if you have any questions, of course, like in the old days, leave them below, and I will get back and um check it in a couple of days and get back with you guys so y'all have a good day. I love y'all, and I will upload this when I get home today. So. Yeah. I'm recording this on Tuesday, so I holla. The buzz.